The word translated means porous bones, and that's what happens with osteoporosis. Bones weaken and then risk fracture. Donna Jones is a fighter, and she's using this workout to give all she has to fighting osteoporosis. I didn't notice any specific symptoms. And that's how osteoporosis can sneak up on you. Postmenopausal women and people with a family history are all at risk, also men over the age of 70. I have a family history of osteoporosis, and my mother died at 76 from a fall. So Donna made some changes in her lifestyle, and now exercise is included in her new manifesto. A cardiovascular workout, and it includes uh, weights and bands, which are so good for, for uh, weight types of activities uh, because if you have osteoporosis. I also do yoga there. She has excellent posture when she sits. Dr. John Ryan diagnosed Donna several years ago. And the reason why we treat it is because it puts you at increased risk of fracture. With osteoporosis, what they've shown is that people that engage in regular aerobic activity, things such as yoga, Pilates, um, Tai Chi, that can reduce the risk of fracture almost as much as medications can. She also has another disorder and takes a steroid to control it. She says prednisone is harsh on her bones, so she adds minerals and vitamins. I take prednisone, and prednisone depletes your um, bones density. Yeah. So I made that change. Uh, I uh, take supplements. I take a calcium supplement to make sure it has zinc and magnesium, and most of all, vitamin D. And once a year, Donna Jones takes an infusion that keeps osteoporosis at bay as well. Dr. John Ryan insists that activity also works to slow the calcium-robbing disease.